webinar on using anchor text in your Active Rain profile and in your blog. Um, anchor text is basically just using text as an anchor for a link. Like in this example, we're using Realtor Vision as the anchor for a link to the Realtor Vision site. We're doing the same thing over here, but we're using the words Virtual Tour Company. And if you notice, I use this throughout my profile, and I point to different pages on the Realtor Vision site. I point to some dealer web pages, some blogs, just a variety of different information. Now, in order to do this, we're going to go over to my profile, and we're going to edit it. And what I'm going to do is come down here and find something to link. I'm going to use Virtual Tour. So what I'm going to do is left click, left click, scroll over what I'm going to use, and highlight it. Then just click this little chain here. That's going to bring up another window where I'm going to enter the URL or the web address. And I'm going to use HTTP to begin this. Okay, and I'm going to point to the Realtor Vision site and open the link in a new window. And just click Insert. Now when I'm done with that, going through here and adding various different anchor text <clears throat> links to different parts of my website. And you want to link to uh, not just the main page, but link to at least two or three other pages throughout your website and use anchor text that kind of describes what's on that page. Like here you see I'm using 2D and 3D floor plans. This link is going to link, and I'll show you what it links to, to my 2D, 3D web page on the Realtor Vision site. We're going to save profile to make sure that the links get saved. Okay, and then I'll look at my profile to make sure all my links are there and that they work. Make sure you're going back and checking afterwards and making sure they actually work. If they don't work, you want to go back to the uh, profile edit mode and find out what's wrong with the URL. But the one that I just made is right here, Virtual Tour. And this is going to open up a new window, which brings me to the Real Tour Vision site. Okay, in order to do this on your blog, just open up your blog. Okay, and I'm going to edit this one. And you would just do the same thing. Just find the anchor text that you want to use. Like, say I want to link to a page about social networking sites on my website. I would just highlight this section right here. Click on the link. Type in my web address. Open link in a new window. And insert the link. It's as simple as that. Be sure to be doing this not only on um, you know, your Active Rain profile and you know, your blog, but you want to also do this in the Realtor Vision blog. You want to do this in other websites, social networking sites, even sometimes in your comments that you leave on other people's blogs. And uh, there's something called no follow, and we really won't get that into that here. But um, a lot of blogs, they have no follow, which means you really don't get any credit for using anchor text in a comment. But um, just get in the habit of entering this anchor text in and linking it. Most um, WYSIWYGs, which is what you see is what you get, have this little chain icon. And it won't highlight unless you actually have the words highlighted here. See, now it highlights, and you can use it. That's the way it works in most uh, WYSIWYGs. So just get in the habit of uh, using anchor text when linking to your site and make sure to read Realtor Vision um, Tour Talk. That's very important. And tune in to our webinars. Have a great night.